Okay, we are going to be today um, taking out this old putting green. As you can see, it's just not been maintained very well. And there's a lot of shade right here. And <clears throat> just kind of looks like maybe some of the areas have kind of settled over the years. You can see there's a big hole right there. And what that does is just trap sand and water. And then eventually egg starts growing algae or mold or whatever you want to call it um, so basically uh, the client called me up and basically i don't know if you can see this but there's a pretty nice slope going that way and basically what we're going to be doing today is just going to raise up that edge we're going to take all those moss rock boulders out we're going to build a about a three inch base under those boulders we're going to compact it and then we're going to put those boulders back around and then we're basically going to level this thing back up he's still going to have undulation he's still going to have some nice uh elevation to some holes and some different breaks and stuff like that but we're just going to kind of raise the green up so it's not so sloped going this way and uh so my guys are going to start cutting this as you can see right here <clears throat> that's a very kind of thick turf and it's got probably six pounds of sand in it so it's going to be extremely heavy so what we do is we just take a a, uh, a sawzall and we just cut little strips and so we're just going to cut little strips until we've cut all the all the strips out we just load those up in the trailer haul them off and then um, we'll start working on the base so it's a it's a very labor intensive uh there's you know there's a science to it and art to it and but that's what we're going to be doing today so as you can see we're starting to cut cut the pieces out and it just goes a lot quicker with that sawzall than using a regular knife blade So we're going to do a retro on this green. That's kind of the process we do it. We're going to recompact the base, build it up, smooth everything, level it, compact it again. We add a light layer of sand uh, just, for, just to get things really, really running smooth. And then we'll start laying out the synthetic grass. We're going to redo his holes. And then this guy will have his uh, golf green back. Helms Landscape Design LLC. If you guys have a green that's not looking so fresh anymore, give me a call. I can fix it. 